I think it's such a fitting quote going into this Wednesday as we celebrate Tata Madiba's centenary year. It's his birthday today. And just as it is uh, people going out celebrating their 70 or 67 minutes to make a difference in somebody else's life, please just remember that today should be like every other day as well. We should be making a difference in people's lives every day wherever possible wherever we can as well. Now, check out our t-shirt. I think it looks pretty cool. Now, this is the official Tata Madiba Nelson Mandela Centenary t-shirt. And you have a choice. You can either wear your heart on your sleeve, or if you're not one for sleeves, you can do it with a t-shirt like this one to make a difference in someone's life. And here's how you can do it. The Nelson Mandela Foundation and Trade Call Investments Apparel have taken on a grand venture to unite the global community in the spirit of Madiba. The campaign is about an iconic t-shirt that commemorates the centenary year of the father of our nation, Nelson Mandela. And it's a t-shirt that depicts the image of Nelson Mandela made up of 240 words that are associated with his vision, his legacy, and that depicts his wisdom. Words like selflessness, love, hope, peace, tolerance, and patience. This idea was conceptualized by our CEO, Herman Pillay, in collaboration with the Nelson Mandela Foundation. And they came up with this concept of an intent to put a million t-shirts on the bodies of people across the world that commemorates the centenary year of Nelson Mandela. Text and the phrases and words in the image, that 240 words was substantially bigger initially. And we were close to 4,000 words. All words were selected from the Nelson Mandela book of quotes and phrases, and that went through to about seven or eight people. Each t-shirt will retail at 150 rand at stores around South Africa, and aside from the good you can do by buying one, it's a really special tea. The ink we use is a water-based ink. It is, carries 100% eco passports. It's got Ecotex approval. All raw ingredients are imported, but all manufacturing is done locally. The pros of water-based ink is there's no texture to the print. It's breathable. Whereas oil-based ink, you can't iron on it. It'll smudge. It's made up of PVC and polymers. And it is generally not as eco-friendly as water-based inks. The benefits of oil-based inks are you can print so much more. But with water-based inks, it's a slow printing ink. But your quality is substantially better. Well, now I'm grown, working, and now I'm working on the Nelson Mandela T-shirt, so which is a privilege for me to be working on this T-shirt. It's such a great honor, and I'm loving it. For me, it was a great experience working on the Mandela T, because seeing that he left us this legacy, and for us to remember him, that is one way for me, working on the T-shirt, that I feel it is super great. Throughout the centenary year, from 2018 into 2019, there'll be a number of significant events and parallel campaigns taking place. The first campaign that we have, which is probably the most exciting, is at the annual lecture that commemorates uh, the centenary day, is a guest speaker in the form of former President uh, Barack Obama, who will be addressing uh, distinguished guests, so we're quite excited about that. The second initiative, which is Mandela Fridays, appeals to people to wear this fantastic, iconic T-shirt every Friday to create awareness about the centenary year. And thirdly, we have the CEO Challenge, which is CEOs being able to challenge each other to either buy these T-shirts, to stock them in their stores, or to distribute them to their employees to help drive this campaign. So throughout the centenary year, we have fantastic initiatives um, lined up. Words such as hope, love, tolerance, patience, integrity. These are values that each of us should practice. Taking the lesson from the father of our nation in terms of how he was able to forgive, let go of the past, focus on the future, drive peace, drive love, and most of all, instill hope in some of the worst situations in our country. I think these are examples of how the everyday person can draw on this campaign for themselves as individuals.